Overall, this is a quality round of Mario Party. On a quality game. Well, in my opinion, nearly all Mario Party games are good. There are only a few Mario Party games that are bad, and I will list all of them off for you right now. Ten in advance. Those two are bad. Like, a lot of people haven't played the handheld Mario Party since there's a very easy way to go about, like, Stop! reviewing them in, like, a couple of words. Basically, DS rocks. You've already seen me play it a little bit. Island Tour is okay, and Advance sucks. So every other Mario Party game is good, Island Tour is okay, and... Oh, you know what? I have to get it too. I have to take Donkey Kong out of this. When you have a chance to kill the monkey, you always kill the monkey. Cincinnati Zoo knows all about that. What was I talking about? I already forgot. Was it Italy or decorating my house? This mini game is pretty slow paced. It is fun because you got a nice little uh, strategy that you can go about with it. Oh. And, uh, yeah, this was actually the first Mario Party 2 mini game I ever saw. Like, uh,. It was on a demo machine at some store. I wish I could tell you which one. Maybe it was a fries. I don't really remember. Um, I think I've lost. Wait, no. If I get it two, then I win. If you have three, you are guaranteed to win. Because then, no matter what, you can pick something that will regard that will result in the other player being forced to get the honeycomb. But yeah, I just saw this on a random. Like, demo machine thing. Well, not really a demo, it's just, you know, a Nintendo 64 under, like, a plastic globe protecting it. And, yeah, it was just on, and no one was playing it, so it was just kind of sitting there. It's like, oh, look at the thing going down. Hey, they're hitting the blocks. A few mini games that literally can play itself. Please don't do that, because I don't want to sit here and watch someone waiting ten seconds in between... Picking a rant, picking a thing on a block. Recognizing it, it's wasting people's time, and if you do it, you're uh, well, worse than Bowser when he takes all of my mini stars, or half my mini stars, but it may as well have been all because it knocked me out of the game. And I'm still bitter about it. Okay, do I want to. Greedy and steal a star, or do I want to be greedy and steal coins? You know what? I want to be the one who single handedly decides that DK is flat out not winning this game. Revenge! Except I don't really know what I'm getting revenge on. I don't, he, most, of his, most of his crimes have, against me have mostly just been him being the one that's winning stuff and not me. So where's the... oh yeah, it's over here. You know what? I'm super rich. Let's just... let's just dump all this money and let it flow out. So I've bro I'm the only one here who has broken the century mark and I don't anticipate anyone else doing it. Although DK might. So DK, your chance for revenge on me is getting to 104 coins and then stealing my... stealing a star from me, which could completely and totally happen. If I wanted to be an even bigger jerk, I could probably put a slow curse on it, but I think I've had enough. Aw oh, man, I wanted to play a bonus minigame. It would have been so fun. This is another one of those games where, like, your character has to do a ground pound, and then they take, like, three days to get up and set ground pound. Like, oh, this is so much work. Uh, the strategy here is just being able to press the Z button almost immediately after getting airborne. That much else to it. Bada bing, bada boom. And I think I, 
I, sh I kind of want to put a replay in here because it totally looks like I won, but just barely. How many turns we got left? Okay, this is the second to last turn. Oh boy, this is what's been going on for longer than I thought. I'm gonna have less time to do stuff than I thought because I still got stuff to do tonight. And I took time out of my busy schedule to play Mario Party. Aren't you all so thankful? Yes, that was sarcastic, if you couldn't tell. I'm pretty bad at sarcasm. Like, when I'm sarcastic, people can't tell. And when other people are sarcastic to me, I can't tell. It's pretty funny. I mean, if it's super obvious, like, this suit is not black. Well, then that's obvious. But if they're like, this suit is black, not, then I can't tell. Oh, goody! We get to see a dual minigame, finally. Kind of surprising it hasn't happened yet, because the way this thing is set up with that whole teleportation mumbo-jumbo, it's kind of set up for this place to be Dual City USA, or it's probably not the United States, but whatever. It could probably be, like, somewhere in the Southwest, maybe. Mexico. Pretty simplistic, you just gotta alternate to have an A and B. Holy crap, 104 coins! He has more than- he has the- He has the coin star now! He's doing the exact same thing that I told him he should have done! Why did I- what was I thinking by giving him that idea? Now I just lost his coins and- Quick! Oh, we gotta have this round end before he has a chance to steal the star back and totally win this game! Oh goody, it's time for a dance! Just follow along the heads. What the? I didn't mean to look that way. What? I lost? Well, this isn't good at all. Must always dance like a guy. Alright, well, I got my, my my prime target. I don't know why I have some bad blood with DK all of a sudden. Because I was thinking when some characters earlier, I thought, you know what, let's not have Peach so we don't have me going crazy over, ah, oh, I must kill Peach like the, for like the eighth time in a row. I am not winning this game if they are smart, although they did both look the same way last time. Well, that kind of sucked. Oh... What I like about that game is, so if you lose, your head gets smaller, but it, you can st you're can still playing. You can continue to lose and have your head get, continue to get smaller and smaller and smaller and smaller! Hey. Alright, well, DK has officially stolen the coin star away from me, which means... I still have a star from him, so... Yeah. Bob on language is weird. I ever I had no idea it was spelled in all dashes, uh, marks, and exclamation points. Duel, 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 duel. All right. If this ends up being super crazy high stakes dueling, then. We're essentially dueling for the minigame star. That is exactly what is happening now. Whoever wins this duel gets the mini. Not uh, get gets the coin star. Stop! Oh, this is so exciting! I'm on the edge of my seat. Um, DK. Yep. DK has successfully held on to his title and is now. Officially filthy rich. Filthy rich monkey with a tie. There's actually quite a few of those. Well, that was a fun and pointless item. I hope you didn't buy it. I honestly don't remember where you got that from. Is there an item minigame a while? I've been kind of zoning out a couple of times. Am I about to make another trip to Boo? Albeit this time not with 50 coins, but... 
<laughs> Must keep going after the monkey. Maybe next time we'll swap Donkey Kong out for Peach. Just swap one huge rivalry with another apparently huge rivalry that I didn't know existed until today. Alright, what is our last minigame going to be? Oh, goody. Instead of playing a new exciting minigame, we get to play an old minigame that I'm not a big fan of. You more or less need to be pretty darn flawless in order to win against these hard computers. Like, you have to know when the bubble is going to burst, and I kind of did, but my controller was like, Hey, you want to keep pushing forward, right? I don't know why my controller is from Brooklyn. Yoshi, you've won that twice now, right? I mean, you are a speed-type character, and none of the rest of us are in Mario Sports games, but that shouldn't matter. Human lives matter. Wait, when did Yoshi get a third star? I don't remember any of this happening. I'm so confused. I'm not guaranteed to win. But I think I'm still most likely going to win. I have more coins than Yoshi, right? It's pretty much the only way the only way that I lose, right? Is if Yoshi gets the happening star. Wait, no. Donkey Kong still got second place. Because Donkey Kong has three stars and I have four. Yeah. So each of the boards in Mario Party 2 has a neat little story thing going on. In this particular one, I you probably aren't aware of because I skipped over most of the dialogue, but there's like a big old treasure and we're all searching for it, and I guess it's riddle themed, and by the way, this is a cow. Oh, wait a minute, a cow doesn't have that weird bump on top of its head. Now I'm going to wrap you in spider silk? I didn't know Bowser was a relative of Spider-Man. I did it, I won! And that's how they reveal the winner, is like this big, like, silhouette comes in and is super vague so that you can't tell who it is. And they're like, oh my gosh. It's Bowser! Oh, this pointing animation. In these early 3D games, like, pretty much everyone is constantly has a, like, their both hands balled up into a fist. That was one of the things I rec started to recognize when graphics got better in the GameCube PS2 Xbox series. Like, oh my gosh, you can see individual fingers! I'm just gonna glue some sausages to the end of my hand, into my ball hands. There, I got fingers now. You look ridiculous. Yeah, hey, I already said that. Well, I won. Now let's get a look at the end of game statistics, because that was a pretty exciting round. I think it's actually safe to say that me stealing a star from Donkey Kong won me the game. Because had that not have happened, I would have... Well, three and he'd have four. I would have more coins, so it's possible that I would have gotten the coin star instead of him. But then again, he also won those two dual minigames, so those might have been what determined the whole game. Minigame Star was within too many games. Give technical coins. Wow. Captain Space Star was nowhere close. And we got ourselves a healthy three battle minigames, which are far more exciting than the item minigames, but at least we got, I got to show them off, so there's that. Item and dual minigames are board specific. Where? you guys enjoyed this round of Mario Party 2. See you guys next week for more Mario Party Madness. Keep using that term until I come up with something better. Bye-bye now.